video hopefully I'm not gonna hold you too long I've been getting a lot of questions about testosterone boosters over the shelf testosterone boosters you know things with zinc in it uh, the asperic acid etc etc you're wondering will it give you significant gains let me tell you this those over-the-counter um, testosterone boosters uh, I thought the name testosterone booster is misleading yeah, when you hear a word like testosterone booster, the first thing that comes to your mind is steroids. You know what I mean? And as we all know it, as we all know it, don't know, steroids work like a motherfucker. Steroids can have you looking like Captain America. Remember Captain America went to that machine, skinny as fuck, came out big as fuck? That's what steroids would do for you if you do what you got to do. If you eat right, you get your training, you know, take your steroids, get your sleep. But... Over the counter testosterone boost is not going to do that for you. It's just going to it's just good for testosterone health. As we all know, men produce testosterone naturally in your nuts. You know what I'm saying? So we all have genetic limits. Some of us have more, you know, growth potential than others. But regardless of the matter, we all produce testosterone naturally. So you know, things like fish oils, olive oils, healthy fats, things like zinc. Maybe even a spare de asperic acid if you want to spend your money on it will help ensure you have testosterone occurring naturally in your body. But it's not going to increase your testosterone, and it's definitely not going to increase your testosterone to a point where you're building muscle like a motherfucker. You know what I mean? All things are there for you with steroids, okay? Now you're going to ask me, well, what if you have a hormone deficiency? What if, like, you, 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 you have a low test? You see your doctor and you have a low test. Well, my friend, over-the-counter uh, testosterone boosters are not going to fix somebody with low tests. If you have low tests, you're fucked, my friend, and you need to see a doctor and get prescribed tests. Okay, you're not going to be natty anymore, you know what I'm saying, but who gives a fuck? If you have low tests, you, you know, and your doctor prescribes it to you, he's not going to prescribe it to you in, like, feel heat type of dosages. But, yeah, you will be having it. If you have a low test, you're going to have to see a doctor, and he's going to prescribe you some tests. So I hope that answers your question. Now, as you may or may not know, I'm not super into the science shit, but I have a friend that is. Ice Cream Fitness. Some of you may be subscribed to him. Some of you may not be subscribed to him. He's a good friend of mine from overseas. He has a channel. He's going to let you know what he thinks right now. What's good, uh. YouTube? You know who it is. It's Jason Blaha with Ice Cream Fitness and Bag Post here. And my boy Chris Jones over at Physiques of Greatness asked me to just chime in quickly and discuss the science behind this and my own TRT. All right, real quick, guys. Most of the over-the-counter testosterone boosting products have not been conclusively proven to work. Even the best ones are hit or miss in study after study, and what they do boost isn't enough, even in the best studies, to significantly increase your gains, to help you burn fat faster, and possibly not even enough to help your energy and libido, and that's best case scenario. So if you think you're suffering from low testosterone, this is a medical issue, it's a serious issue, don't play around with over-the-counter products. Go see your doctor, get your blood work done, if your testosterone is low, get referred to an endocrinologist and you need to get on real testosterone replacement therapy. I know that for me, it was one of the best things I ever did because at 30, my testosterone levels tested through the roof, just like an 18-year-old, and four years later, they tanked. And I would say within 48 hours of that injection, I noticed a world of difference. Way more difference than you're going to notice with anything over the counter. So if you think you're suffering from it, go see your doctor. You need to get on the real deal. Don't play around with supplements for a serious medical issue like that that's going to mess with your gains, going to mess with your health, it's going to mess with your mind. And there it is. That's two opinions right there, guys. But hey, you don't have to take my word for it. You want to spend your money on the shit? Go right ahead. I don't work for your money. You work for your money. So you can spend your money however the fuck you please. Okay? Well, anyway, guys. I'm about to roll out. Don't forget to subscribe to my boy Ice Cream Fitness if you haven't. Real cool guy. Really in depth with the science. He's very versatile with his videos. 
try to cover things from all different angles just like myself. Don't forget to like my shit. Comment, subscribe. Holler back at your boy.